All right, ladies and gentlemen, uh, it's time to com- continue with the next chapter. This is actually a really good chapter. I just, mm-hmm. because you, you get a lot of, like, now that we're, like, past, like, um, like, a lot, like, the majority of the early game, like, we're, like, we're in the early game transition into the mid-game at this point, we got a lot of features unlocked here. Yeah. Chapter 5, Hopefully. Liberation of Grust, Auburn Keep. Though this is a pretty annoying chapter, I will say. The shocking news brought by Sido was a terrible blow to Marth. Harden was once not only a comrade in arms, but a trusted confidant and irreplaceable friend. Yet, why attack Altea? What have I done wrong? Filled with frustration, Marth hurried his return to his homeland. The first oh. barrier stood in his way. That's okay. Olburn Keep, headquarters of the Grustian Occupation Army, led the, by the general... The evil General Lang. <laughs> also, the genial... Also known as the Nest of Evil. Wow. English. <laughs> Madison, this was decided, it's been decided that we're going to war with Arganea. Arganea will not be an easy opponent. They have one of the most powerful militaries on the continent. We're ready to face anything, sir. Although, we still lack experience, I man. We have to grow stronger. Indeed. Madison, are you aware of the drill grounds that operate across the continent? Drill grounds, sir? It costs a bit of money, but if you go in... But if you go practice in one, you can get stronger. It might be a good idea to let our more inexperienced men have a go. Have a go. All right, so yeah, we have the drill guns. Basically, how the drill guns are is that, um, and I do love the scene. It's I think this is the mm-hmm. um, um the um arena theme for Sacred Stones. Yeah, it's from Sacred Stones. Oh my god, I love it so much. It's so funny how we just got done with Sacred Stones and we go right into this. I know. I was just thinking that. I was like, damn, we just finished that one too. So how the drill guns work is, oh yeah, we have to talk about Sita as well. How the drill guns work is that it's basically the arena, but the thing is that you don't get money from this. That's basically all the drill guns is, and we are going to be using that, because we do need some experience. So, what I'm actually going to do is I'm actually going to send Paul into the drill guns once and then I'm going to promote her, because the thing is though, she's, like, her stats are too good not to promote her, and I do need a, in order for a strategy on my map, for this map to work, I do need to promote her, actually. And we also have uh, Rickard here and Mars. There's not a guy in chapter in this chapter, but it's the next chapter. And how you get is that you have to complete a certain amount of turns. But if you recruit Rickard and he's alive, um, you get the guy in chapter automatically. It's so easy to get the guy in chapter. Oh, nice. Chapter for six hours. Um, we have George here. Don't attack him or go in his range. You don't get him in this chapter. You get him later on. Um, and also be careful of his men because they have silver balls and a maniac mode. They were scary. Yeah. Like, don't like and George is even more serious as the Parthia. He is the Parthia, yeah. Um, you do want to like, like, and plus the thing is why I want to send um um Paul up here, which I should just change the message right here because I think we're here. Um, actually, I'm not sure. Yeah, it's better. Um, you, I want to fly her up really fast and get this master seal. And um, the thing is though that since Rigor has the VIP card, you do want to recruit this chef because that there's a secret shop. Right here, actually, and it sells one Master Seal. Just one. But, so, you want to get as many Master Seals as you can. Um, let's see. There are also, um, like, there's a Cavalier here with a Silver Sword, of all things. And that is just scary. There's two of them. And the thing is, though, is that why I want to promote Paula is because she has to, I have the Flycatcher. Now, she can't do it on promoting, but with this, if she promotes with this promotion case that she gets, she can one-run all these flyers with the, um, uh, with the um, uh, flycatcher by so I got the house up. Oh, nice. So, what I'm actually going to do is I'm actually going to go into the armory and I'm going to sell that boy we got from the boss, which thank god they gave us that. There we go, 5,000 gold. And also, by the way, just be aware you can die in this, so be careful when you go in here. So I'm actually going to make a safe save right here because I think this is warranted. Plus, I could just load, like, you know, the save mm-hmm. point if I wanted to. Right. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. Like, also, the enemies you face in here are pretty tough, so just be prepared. And no, uh, you don't get your money back from the uh, big drill guns. Hit points, strength, defense. Alright, nice. That was a pretty okay. good one. And I don't think I need to send anyone else in. I could send Mass in, but honestly, I don't think he needs it. 
and you have to be a fight in order to like promote. So you can't send your like your your um uh, you can't send your um uh, healers in because they're not gonna do anything. All right, so let's see. Where is Paula? All right, we'll get rid of that steel bow. And this was that master seal. Let's promote her. Our first promotion. You think hey. it'd be massive, but it's like. Ooh. Minus one magic, plus five defense, minus three res, and plus two weapons. Look at that. She can now use axes. She has aim again. Look at that. Oh my god. Yeah, really good. Like she. Dash. Oh my god. Nice. Right, so you got some competition. Oh and my god. You. <laughs> I'm I'm playing Sacred Stone still. I'm replaying through it. I need you to know my Erica. Is insane. <laughs> she is about to promote. She's level here. I have a screenshot of it. She's level twenty. Um, she has capped skill and speed oh and sixteen strength. She has not been given a single stat booster. It, no, she got she got a uh, a seraph rope. Yeah, unpromoted. Level yeah. twenty lord. Sixteen strength. Twenty skill. Twenty speed. So, I don't know how people be getting these bad Erica's because like our Erica was great, my Erica's are always great. Alright, and we go. Alright. Uh, oh yeah, so we have Shia to talk about, or see that. Um, so Sita is basically the secondary lord of, um, um, uh, well, kind of like the secondary lord. She was the secondary lord of, of um, uh, Shadow Dragon, or she was treated mm -hmm. as a lord of Shadow Dragon. Here, she's, um, pretty good in my opinion. She only has a 30% strength growth, but here's why I think she's so great. So she has an 80% skill and luck growth, so she's gonna cap this without a problem. And she has a 95% mm -hmm. speed growth, so she's gonna oh my cap God. it by the time she hits level 10. Um, I do think Sita gets a little bit shacked because of her low strength, but she's pretty mm -hmm. good, like, in this game. And I think that she is way better than Mark, because here's the thing. So, we talked about how there's literally, like, the 80% of the enemies in this game are basically caps, or, like, on heads, which Mark always has one travel disadvantage with the Rapier. Mm -hmm. And the Rapier is good, but the thing is, though, the plot, her wing spear is better, because it has three more might, it has ten less hits, mm -hmm. but it has the same crits. So, Sita does more damage because of the Wing Spear, and she actually does not have over Tribal Disadvantage against the Cavs and Armor that you're going to be facing. So, I do think that Sita is really good, and she has really good base stats to start off with. I do think you need to give her an Angelic Rope, though, but, like, so many people in this game think that, like, 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 like so many people think. Um, I do think that she's better than Katria, though I don't know how good she is with Paul, but that's what we're going to be using this pack to try out, because I've never used Paul and Sita at the same time. Um, five stars. said we are or we aren't using Sita? We are going to be using Sita. Oh, beautiful. I used use them both, but I haven't used them both at the same time. So we're going to see if Paula is going to be better than Sita, or if Sita is going to be better than Paula. Mm -hmm. But here's the thing, though. Sita is going to be going to a Draco Knight. We're going to be using an Elysian Whip on her that we get later. Because you can do Elysian Whips in this game. You can't do it in Shadow Dragon without using the online shop. But the thing is, the online right. shop in the DS would be just this video. And you can't use the Amber. But hey. thankfully, that's what this remake did. You can't get Elysian Whips without using the Elysian Shell. So, yeah. Five stars for Sita, in my opinion. I'm so glad that you like Sita because she is probably... I would say that she's, she's like, in my top five favorites in all of, like, the Arcanea games. Oh. I love Sita so much. To me, she's like... What did you say her strength growth was? Uh, 30%. Yeah, so I do wish her strength growth was a little bit higher. Um, and she didn't have that solid base strength that Pala had, but I do think she's still going to turn out immensely good because of what we or what you talked about with the wing spear. Um, and you can forge this too, which I think I'm actually yeah. going to do. Yeah, it's... It's serious. It's really good. Like, 
I think you it's, really I you, you miss out if you don't use Sita because, like I, you said, she's pretty much like a secondary lord. Mm -hmm. I personally think it's her saving grace. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if she, she had that. I think she'd be rich. <laughs> yeah, she has her own right here, and it's a lance. It's like how in Sacred Stones, like Regin Leaf is better than the rapier. Like the Wing Spear is better than the rapier. Mm -hmm. Um, no, I'm also going to give her a 5 out of 5 stars. She is absolutely busted, in my opinion. <laughs> hey, how much experience does she have? Um, uh, but yeah, as you can see, even in the arena, like... <laughs> mm -hmm. But as you see, without the wing spear, I do think you can get another one, though. But I am going to be going to the armor. Yeah. I'm actually going to force this up a little bit. Okay, how much will it cost you to fix this here? Yeah, I think I'll do that. Alright, oh man, why don't you do this? Okay, won't be a good lance for that. It won't be a good name for this lance. Mm -hmm. I am not good at naming things, so I'm not the person to ask. <laughs> there we go, got it. 69er. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> yep, it's a fish show. <laughs> Alright, so oh my god, Jesus, that is a lot of talk conversations. Alright, let's start off with Oh my god. Hey Master, this isn't bothering me. Oh wait, we have to bring Julian for this map. Fuck. If I'm not mistaken, my pal lives around here. My pal? Yeah, he's called Rickard. I watched my hands of theory, but I hear Rickard continues to see the place. If you see him, leave him to me. I'll pursue him to quit that cheating business. Alright, Barst. Sir Ogma, is something troubling you? Yes, I am indeed troubled. About a former subordinate of mine, a man named Barst. Sir Barst, was it? When you say subordinate, you mean for Talos. Yes, he used to be a mercenary fighting for King Talos and Princess Sita, just like me. After the previous war was over, it seems he had an idea and left for Arcanae. And he's with the enemy? No, it seems he did join the Arcanae army, but he left it because he's tired of fighting. If you happen to meet Barst, I'll leave, leave him to me. That's my go-to actions are right there. Current size. My greatest fear is when we realize Emperor Hardin of Arcanae had planned to invade our kingdom from the very start. If we, were, if we conserve the speed of this invasion, the Christian expedition of Rubai and Massano will be under traps. Make no mistake of it, the Arcanae army is not our enemy. We will be returned to Altea after going through the strong, the strong call of Lang's occupation of We cannot let Lang be, especially after he instead our kingdom and torment the people of Gross. Alright, Gordon, Madison 2. Madison, training again today, huh? Sir, Sir Gordon? Good work, that's what an Altea knight is made of. I don't think I'll be left in the dust. What's the matter? Do you have a fever? What? No, sorry. Was that really that weird? If you must ask, yes, you were. I knew it. I thought I became, if I'd become more dignified by changing the way I speak, so I tried to mimic the tone of, the, of a senior knight I respect, but I see. I guess it really can't be somebody I'm not massive. Do you have any ideas of what I should try next? I don't know if it'll help, but what do you think of changing your looks? Hey, good idea. I should make myself look more imposing. Yeah, I ought to grow a beard. Massey, do you think I look more dignified with a beard? <laughs> oh my god. Did you laugh? You matched me with a beard and laughed, didn't you? Sorry, I didn't mean it. No, it's fine. I guess it really wants to be. What am I supposed to do? Why don't you cut your hair? That's what I did. Right. Shave your head, bro. Oh, what? Oh, okay. I did not. That didn't count. I, didn't count. I have to change the time again. Greetings. You are Prince Mars Warger, a correct? And you are Dame Kedra of the Macedonian White Wings. Oh wait, what am I doing? <laughs> I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> Just Kedra is fine, thanks. We're comrades, so I'd be happy if we could talk normally between us. Alright, I like that too. We've already fought together for a while. That we have. I've seen you battle many times. You fight with peerless devotion to protect Prince Marth. Just as I'd expect from Prince Marth's royal guard. I'm honored, thank you for your praise. I watched you fight too, you're incredibly powerful, I admire you as a warrior. Huh, you embarrass me. In the coming battles, I bet we'll fight together many more times. I'm counting on you. Yes, likewise. Sorry, right, this is probably your last chapter, if not this was right. your last chapter. <laughs> Alright, Lynn and Madison. I don't believe we've been introduced. I am Madison, Prince Mars Royal Guard. I'm Lind, daughter of Pontifex Maloa. Pontifex Maloa, is he famous? Wow, you don't know father? 
No, I know. Sorry. Please forgive my ignorance. I come from the country. Though I'm sure he's a great man. He is. There's not a soul in Arcanea who doesn't know Father. He was a wonderful Pontifex, respected by everyone. I've always wanted to be like him. I see. He sounds like someone I'd like to meet. Is he in Arcanea right now? He passed away, killed by the Dark Pontifex, Garna. I see. My condolences. It's fine. Don't worry. What about your family? I don't have any one anymore. I used to have my grandfather, but he's gone too. Oh, I'm sorry. No, it's fine. How should I put it? Is it draw or square? We're even. Yes, that works. <laughs> You're funny. <laughs> Very well, Madison. It was nice meeting you. Pleasure is mine. Oh god. Alright, Paula and Madison. Ha! 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 Get, uh, I feel dizzy. Madison, are you alright? Dame Paula. I'm okay. Sorry you had to see that. You look unsteady. This isn't like you. What were you doing? The truth is, I thought I wasn't trading hard. It's the only fucking thing this guy can say is trading. I know. So I decided to train five times hard. Oh my god. How sudden. Then it's no wonder you collapsed. It's okay. When training is hard, train even hard. My grandfather told me that. You know, my grandfather sounds like a psychopath. <laughs> right. That'll do you no good. You're pushing yourself too hard. Here, sit down. Let's take a break. No, I can still... Let's take a break. Yes, ma'am. What the... Yes, that's more like it. Wow, he just got whipped right there. <laughs> yeah. You won't get strong if you force yourself to train too hard. You need to understand your limits. Here's some water. Please have some. Thank you. Well, I did what she said. Have some water. Stay hydrated or else. <laughs> I'll get more if you need it. Just ask. But that's enough training for now. Do you hear me? Yes. <laughs> God. All right. Riss and Madison. Oh, this is Sir Madison. Sir Riss. Thank you kindly for saving me from that predicament the other day. Don't mention it. I'm always, I'm always the one getting myself wounded. Sorry for the trouble. It's no trouble at all. Your daily growth always enthralls me, Sir Madison. Thank you. Oh, looking at you brings back memories of the children of the monster in Altea. There's a monster in Altea? Yes, I built a small monster after the last war. There are many delightful children there. Heavens, that's admirable. The children there grow stronger with every passing day, living in harmony with nature. Just like you, Mr. Masson. It's very kind of you. Yes, even your naughty sides are akin. And Sir Riss? Oh, do excuse me. Naughty sides? What? Okay, uh, anyway. So, yeah, I decided to reclass uh, Malaysia back to Hugo because I do feel like we're going to be needing two heroes for this map. And honestly, yeah. she's not doing that much damage as a stage. No, she's not. Or as a mage. Unfortunate. <laughs> yeah, I am really torn about maybe just using the Malaysia or you can get I might just bench all my heroes and just use Mary. Because yeah, they're, they're, not, they're not. They're not. Alright, so. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wait, we have to bring Julia for this map, so. I think I might just bench one of my archers, actually. I think I'm gonna bench him. I'm gonna bench more for this chapter. I wanna give Ryan some experience. Gordon's level 12 already. And I would rather get Rickard on this chapter than the next chapter. Because you can't get him in the next chapter, you don't talk to him. But you miss out on the VIP. Alright, let's save and let us go. Oh wait, I have to do the house every time, so let me actually just do that real quick. Let's change the fog. Can't really see anything. It should be. Nope, that's not what we need to do. Okay, there we go. Let's see. Alright, you bellow. Uh, got me a quick axe. Ooh. Oh wow. Sirius got some training. Okay. Ogma got some training. And Lynn got speed and res. Ooh, okay. Luke, go away. Seriously. I don't want to talk <laughs> Alright, nice. Okay, we got a quick accent. That's good. We just got that time. I'm actually going to get that right now. Oh, is this gonna give me... What is this axe right here? Please don't tell me it's E. It's D? Okay, so he can look... Okay, nice. He can still steel axe. So let's see. Barst. Um, let me see. So he has E rank. Or D rank. So... Oh, I can't use the hammer yet. That would have been so good. 
but he can't. Ooh, the board and cord axe. I also got this um, off camera. This is a really good axe. Ooh. Yeah, I think I'll give the quick axe and the board cord axe. <laughs> Alright, now we can save and now we can move. So let me just. I just want to switch my clock back over. There we go. Alright. So let's make a save state right here. I should. I actually, I should probably do that when we switch. Yeah, I gotta get those numbers off screen. God damn it! Okay, hold on one second. What the? Oh my god! Oh my god! Why are this? All right, so Commander Lane, the old Tanner army has arrived. You more? Why are you so panicked with their nation and, and name and ruins? The old Tans are of no consequence to us. But Sir George left, left to call the rebellion. Can we ruin with just our troops? Why didn't you tell me earlier? Call George back to the castle this instant. While you're there, find that hired sword Navarre and bring him here. General Taurus, I'm heading inside. You will defend this location to your last breath. Do not let the enemy get close. Do I make myself clear? Captain George, you've re restored orders to return to the castle immediately. Orders from Lang, huh? I'm not too fond of them. But his treatment of our people is simply intolerable. To pour beneath him is an insult. Pain at his orders on like, But, Captain, you'll be accused of treason. Captain, you can't be planning to defect to Altea. No, that's not an option. If I were to defect now, I'll drag the entire platoon down with me. So, for that reason alone, I will absolutely not take any risk that might be of me. Captain George, anyway, inform everyone. Do not move from your stations. However, if the enemy approaches, you may engage them. Okay, so let me try and fix this now. So let's see, save. I think if I load it, it should restore back to normal. Why are the numbers? That's weird. Huh. Hang, hang on one second. Let me try resetting the emulator every time I fix it. What the? Okay, let me try. All right, let me try closing and mm -hmm. reopening it. That is weird. I don't know why that did that. Alright, I should pause the recording, but I'm sure technical difficulties. Alright, and let me just load the save state. Thank God I did this. And yeah. Oh yeah, I see it went away already. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I don't know why I did that. Alright, so let's see. Recruit. Oh, he's up there. Oh wait, okay. You know, actually, let me just see this. Because all of my can't reach him on the first turn. I just didn't place him properly. There we go. Okay, now he can reach him. So Julian can't reach him regardless, so it doesn't really matter. There we go. Now we can begin the map, finally. Wait, what? Oh, wait, no, that's... That's not Ogma, that's Madison. Oh. Oh my god, I swear I'm great. Well. I promise. Damn it, that's the thing about this game, is that these sprites, they, these sprites look all the same, so you don't know who's who. But they actually like the portrait. Okay, so yes, that's Pog. Okay, let's save and let's try this again. Alright, Pog, please. Thank you. Long time no see, Bars. Captain Ogma, why are you here? Another war has started. Once again, I found under Prince Mars Band. Bars, let us your strength. We need you. I got nothing to do with fighting now. Well, that's what I would say if it were anyone else. Captain I owe you. You saved our sorry asses now on, on more than one occasion. Just uh, Captain Agma, just save the world. Do whatever you want. Alright, we got Bars. So, let me give you these axes. Talk about it. So, yeah, Bars. He is the strongest of the fires you can get, um, in my opinion. While Boris is good for when I course the fast one. But Boris is not slow by any means. Like, he's a level 5 fighter with these base stats. He's gonna put in, like, a lot of work. Like, trust me. If you want a good fighter, I honestly think Bars is best. Cord is second, and then Board would be, like, last. So, in my opinion, I think 
Mars is a pretty good fighter. If you you can like make him like a warrior or a berserker when you promote him, and he'll put in more because of the axes that he has. There is D rank, so I do think you need to, you should give him like if you're gonna use him like do get him up to C rank as fast as possible because there's a lot of armor knights in this game and Mars being able to wield the hammer it just makes him a god. So yeah, I think um, Mars is a pretty good fighter. I'll rate him four or five stars actually. Would you give him? Four stars out of five. Oh, okay. I do agree, he is the best out of the three fighters that you get. Um... Or my headset just beeped. Did I, did I do something? No, okay. Um... I do think he is the best out of the three fighters. If you're gonna use any one of them, I would pick him. Um... Still, fighters aren't really my favorite thing, personally. Usually my axe users are gonna be my uh, Draco Knights or my heroes. Okay, I was um, gonna say, if you don't like fighters, then how do you use axes in this game? Yeah, that's that's usually what my axe users are. I don't really care too much for fighters and berserkers and warriors and all that. Um, but he is, like, worth using, you know? If I'm gonna pick one out of the three of them, it's gonna be Bars. It's not gonna be Border Cord. Um, so I'm gonna give him a three out of five stars. I think I gave the other ones two. I'll give him a three. Okay. And we can't reach Rickard on the first turn because um, I don't think I don't think Rickard moves them. If I remember correctly, these thieves do run away and they move. They run away up to here. So you want to catch them as fast as possible. So um, I can reach this. Oh god. Um, okay. So Paula, how does she do? She doesn't kill, what's the problem? Okay, I really don't want to. Okay, so let me see. Six res. Okay, this might <laughs> seem like a bad idea, but I think this is perfect. Oh, nice, have one shot with the silver lance. Okay. There we go. And now we got that guy's master suit. Thank you. And with Sirius, I can train now around to a javelin. And these two should be fine. And Madison. Oh, actually, how does the bars do? Uh, nice. I. Well, if he hits twice... Nice! Okay, there we go. Good job. I just didn't think it was going to hit there. Take it. Fire sword. Oh, that made it. What? What's... Oh, wait, I think this is just... Yeah, don't go too close to um, part of George's squad because they will attack you. Um, there is a physics staff guy here, which you can get. I'm going to try and get it, but I'm not going to like try and like lose a unit over it, though. Oh, wait, why did I... No, no, wait, I think that's just Rickard. Okay, yep, I was right. Ooh, ow. I don't think anyone's going to attack Parks. Uh, nope, okay, I'm fine. Ugh. Yeah, Paula transitioning to Dragon Knight does her a little bit so. Oh my <laughs> god, nice, yeah. Oh, yeah. wow. And we got a pure one. Uh, I'm actually gonna keep that. Oh my god, are you serious? Ow! Are you kidding me? Holy shit. Wait, what? Oh, what? Rick or Paul? Okay, so Rickard does leave, actually. No, wait. Oh, fine. I meant to rescue Julian. My bad. <laughs> God, I'm, I swear to God. There you go. I meant to rescue Julian, so that way I can actually talk. Hey, Rickard, I see you haven't tired of sailing. Ah, Chief, and that, nice to see you. Well, I was planning on working with you and making loads of money, but you had to go in and cut the business. Well, I had over here for that beautiful fire, and then nothing mean, that's just too cool. You know, I love to leave me that little to you. Cannon, you little fink. People get the wrong idea about us if you can talk about that. Alright, forget about the thing that comes with me to fight for justice. 
Alright then. I'll follow you anyway. I do adore you, Chief. Okay, uh, anyway. So, uh, yeah, here we have Rickard. Rickard is basically just a worse version of Julian in every way. Mm -hmm. He has lower levels, like just all sets are lower. His growth rates are lower as well. I think that Rickard is just like, you know, like, he's just not good. Like, the only thing that's redeeming about him is his speed and luck. Everything else about him is just like garbage. Um, even now he has the same sort of like as Julian. I just don't think that these are good in this game in general. Julian at least has some merit because he has good growth rates and he can't level the three. Rickard's the same, but he just has lower base stats and lower level than Rickard, in, or lower than Julian in every way. I just don't think Rickard's like worth using. Julian, I think I rated three. I'm just gonna rate Rickard two stars. Like he's just. Not good. I don't remember what I gave Julian, but Rickard is like you said, just a worse Julian. Um, and thieves in this game, they can't promote. They can't change classes. Um, so that's always something to keep in mind. Um, the thing is, is like, you just, you just, you didn't really need another thief, you know? <laughs> They're like, hey, you know, here's this thief that, you know, I mean, I guess sometimes having two thieves is nice, but even then it's, I would rather bring someone else, you know? I already have to make room for one thief. I don't need another one. If Julian died, then here's your replacement. But, um, yeah, uh, it's it's a one out of five for me. Okay. I mean, these are losing luster because they can't, like, you have Mark who can open chests. I mean, I know it sucks you really get your lore to chest opening duties, but, like, like <laughs> seriously, right. it's just not worth it. Also, you need to be careful because there are these ballistas here, which I just, they, I hate them. It sucks that this guy is actually, do I have a pure rock? No, I don't. Okay. Alright, and then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to deposit the iron sword and, like, I guess you can keep an eye on but I'm depositing the VIP card into the call point now. Why have the chance? Mm -hmm. Alright, let's get parsed. Alright, try the boring cordyx. Move here, I should be fine. I'm a little bit worried about Julian because he's kind of like exposed right now. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, Jesus. Oh, nice. Okay, I actually think. Okay, I'm fine with that. Ow, I'm not fine with that. Oh, nice. Nice. Thank you for the pure water. I'm actually gonna keep that. And I actually mean it this time. Ow, thankfully I am with the job. Thank you, serious. Hey, a fire pump. Not that I need it. Hey, get back here, dude. I can't believe he lived with one HP. Jesus. Man, if I have Julian go after this guy. Okay, I need to heal him up though first. Um, Alright, it's a men staff. Alright, so you meet a second level up, level 5. Skill, speed, luck. Can you get magic, girl? Please. This is hard. Alright, I have to use the steel lance. Or silver lance, my bad. Alright, thank you for the master seal. Let's see, how does Bars do? Okay, he gets one shot. Uh, 
Ah, uh, let me see. Where's Mark? Okay, there he is. I actually have to... Let me see. Okay, I'm gonna deposit Devil Sword for now. And I actually need to give Powell that flycatcher. Bars, please don't miss. No! Oh my god. Oh. Okay, nice. You dodged that. Nice. Alright. Well, I guess I can get the good shit up. I am. God, yes. Ah. It's so hard to announce my aim sometimes. So these guys are gonna come for serious Jesus Christ. I don't think he doubles. Oh no, he does actually. Ah, uh, I think he'll be fine, because I think only that one super sword I can reach him. Ooh, but still, damn, this is doing a lot of damage. I think this is the only guy that can reach him. Yep, okay, nice, I'm safe. But I do have to get moving because there is going to be a thief that spawns from like this bottom before we go and destroy this village. This village contains the horn stop and I would like to have that. I think if you move inside this guy's range, you actually do pull him. Alright, so let me see. 25 minus 12, that's 13. Okay. Yeah, let me see. 14 speed. Oh, I actually don't double this guy regardless of what I do. Okay. I do think I'll actually start moving mass. I'll actually have mass going down here. So let me see. Let me grab the armor slayer. Thankfully, I can hold it. And Martha, I should send down this one as well. And next turn, I'll actually use the safe button. Okay, nice, and I do pull these guys. And, ooh, uh, I think I double these guys? Oh, okay. Yeah, and this is why I want Shit. the fly catch. Because you make mince me out of these white ones. No, don't heal him up, please. Don't heal him. No, oh no, that's not good. I should really kill this guy. Yeah, that's why the physics app is so annoying, because it can reach anyone on this map. Pretty sure? Yeah, it can reach anyone on the map, so that's really annoying. spawn the thief just yet. Alright, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually have serious save here. And I'm just gonna make a safe save here just so that way I don't have to keep reloading mm -hmm. it. And I'll pull this guy with the flycatcher. Let me see, 17 speed. Oh yeah, she doubles these guys. Okay, nice. 
That's why I had to promote her, because without the promotion... I mean, she could have done with the promotion, but here she's more bulky to take these guys out. And how do I do this with the... Oh, nice, okay. I don't think these guys know if you're on the floor, so that's not bad. Oh, nice, I have another safe But this range isn't like the armor knights, I think this is just the magic of this stuff, which is so annoying. Yeah, like I said. Wow, 19% chance to hit. And I don't think you pull the armor knights from that range though. Ow. Thank god for the flycatcher. I'm so glad about this. I don't think I would have been able to do this without it. And a level for Paula. She's now level hey. first level. Hit points, skill, defense, res. Hey, she got res. Okay, this guy does have a uh, silver axe. So let me see. 24 minus 7, that is 17. See that? Okay, yeah, you know, I should have seen it. You need to come this guy, because I do want to give her some experience. I'll already the kill. I really do not want to move up these forwards. Oh wait, what? Oh yeah, that's right. They don't expend their ammo unless they hit you. What? That actually hits? I'll send the flycatcher to combo because I don't need it anymore. Alright, and you know what? I'll actually have a bar stuck in the safe place. Okay, I just sit right there. Alright. Okay, hey. Madison. Let's do this. <laughs> Dodge. Alright, level for Madison. Hit points, strength, speed, luck. Nice! Okay, I have speed now. So skill and speed is capped for Madison. Projection 44.5 degrees fire! <laughs> Ow, okay, yeah, I think I'm dead. Yeah, I am so dead. Ow. Man. Okay, well, that happened. Luckily, I do have a save point. Okay, this is so annoying. I hate this. Like, they're not coming even though I'm in their range. This is why I hate the of this game sometimes. No, I didn't. I didn't mean to end my career. I mean, it doesn't matter for the most part. Okay, what if I go there? Hopefully, that pulls them now. Oh, okay, here comes the thief. Ooh, ready, boys? Look at all the all, all the work. It's never a better time to attack that much of villages. Dude, there's one on the map. What are you talking about? Oh, wait, what? Okay, so from here, the boss is moving. Ow. Please dodge. Pass it. Come on, dodge it. Nice. Sir. Do I pull the armor knights now? Okay, now I pull them. Oh, my God. This game's a nice. Ow, pass it. Don't kill him, please. Can I get that same good level up? Hit points, strength, luck, defense. Get, 
cap your speed? Oh, what? Okay, thank God. Ow! No, don't heal them up. Okay, massive back off. Okay, I think I'll just uh, equip the, the steel axe and I'll just like, wait. Uh, serious? Get your ass back here. <laughs> we need you back here, bro. Actually, I may be able to just kill the boss right here, but... Oh yeah, I can just do this. I doubt that Storm Voice can deal that much damage. Like, how much does it do? Okay, uh, the DA hits. Uh oh. I think probably can damage it. Oh shit. Oh my god, are you serious? Ow. Oh my god. Okay, I was not expecting that much damage. Okay, let me try that again. Okay, I actually dodged that time. Oh, please dodge. Okay, thank you. Okay, Linda, I cannot have you there, apparently. Oh my god, nice job, Master. Alright, come on, Master, get a good level up. Come on, hit points, strength, speed, luck, defense, Ooh. nice! Okay, that was that's the best one. Mars like throw his okay, he can throw his axe. No, oh god, pow, don't kill him. Please, don't kill him. God damn it. Ah. Oh. General Light, Ulti is too strong. Oh no. I think that Archer's gonna kill him now. Well, we got the Gemini. Mm -hmm. And let's see, that gives. Strength and magic. Yeah, my strength and magic. Okay, no, no, that guy can't reach you now. Okay, never mind. Alright, we're fine. Ah, uh, this guy, but I'm not scared about that guy. Yeah, yeah, we know. Count. Oh, oh! Oh my god. Oh my god, for a second I thought that hit, and I was like, oh my god. Nope, that one point of defense saved. Ow. Oh, nice, oh. Madison. There we go. Okay. 
Yeah, we basically got the majority of this chapter down. Once you get rid- oh, okay. Alright, let's- oh my god, are you kidding me? No, oh my god. Gotta love physics. What are you just saying about half love? Seven. Uh, I don't know if it's worth getting at this point. Alright, Glasswell going out with a bang. Nope, okay. Oh, only three. What is this guy's strength? Uh, only I guess the javelin just sucks. Dodge bars. Nice! Good job. <laughs> the fighter animation looks so weird. I know. <laughs> and they're with that giant axe and they just like run off. Hello for Malaysia, hit points, skill, speed, luck, res. No uh, magic. Nope. We're not allowed to get magic. Who needs I magic guess. in this game before going? Who needs magic when you're a healer, right? Ooh, nobody. Nobody. Nope. Not us. <laughs> apparently. Oh yeah, this guy can- oh yeah, be careful the cybers because uh, for some reason they can walk on water for some reason. Hmm. <laughs> it's so weird. Okay, yeah. Dead. Alright, Paula is now level 3. Strength, skill, speed. My god. What does she do with the six and nine? Oh my god. Alright, dude, you wanna come at me? Come at me. I got the six and nine right here. <laughs> Go get her, bro. Hey, nice shot, serious. I wonder will he double? Yep, he does. Oh my god. Alright, now Sirius is now level 3. Hit points, strength, skill, luck, defense. Oh my god. Why train a paladin when you have this monster power? Oh, oh my god. Jesus. Dude, did you not see what happened to your last buddy? Okay, nine damage. So if I just heal her up with the steel lance, I should be fine. Alright, nice. We're almost to the stone. Alright. Almost to the castle. I cannot believe this. <laughs> Yeah, and I'm blocking these forces because I know reinforcers come out of them. Mm -hmm. Ow. Yeah, I might be able to kill this guy. No, never mind. Oh. Yeah, I'm not gonna get that because I'm stuck at this point. It's not gonna... Oh my gosh, she doubles the beat. Are you serious? Too good. And massive. Okay, nice. He doesn't kill this uh, this uh, ballista. Never mind. Oh well. <laughs> so much for that. That's the end of that. <laughs> All right. Well, while we, I'm gonna have a. Um, I'm basically just gonna do like a bunch of buying and selling now. Well, mostly buying. Mm -hmm. Because Martha has to go and get that doge, and also I need to do some shopping in these well, shops. Right. 
Actually, I can send Ryan in to do, do the shopping. So yeah, here's the secret shop. I have to say, this is a pretty clever place to keep a secret shop, though. It is. Like, right in between the vendor and the owner. Because who would go there? Yeah, I know. What do these places sell again? There's one. Uh, nothing I really need. So I think it's just basic equipment this vendor sells. Yeah, I yeah, I don't need this stuff. I'm pretty good. Okay, yeah. The secrets yeah, the as long as I got the um, master set, I'm pretty fine. Plus, it's gonna take some time for Martin to like, get back. Oh, if it isn't Prince Moth, I wonder how my friend over Lena is from. What? You don't know? I see. Do you, you, you still want this unknown stuff? At least if Lena's pupil militia were around, I'm sure she could use it. But whatever would be the case, I'm no use for a souvenir place. Cool. Could make good use of it. So, yeah, we got the Hummer staff. So, only Lena and Malaysia can use it. That's why I'm hell bent on training Malaysia. But, as you can see, that's not going so well. Right. <laughs> yeah. Like, that's the only reason why I'm training Malaysia. Because I want her, if I'm using the Hummer staff, mm -hmm. I mean, you don't need, I don't need to train her because if, as long as I feel her, that's enough right there. So it would be nice to at least have her use it, so... Alright, and yeah, I think, um, actually, Paula could be, um, uh... Oh yeah, she can one round this guy. Just be careful, because George's squad is... Yeah, yeah, I'm not going scary. to... Scary, yeah. I've done the stupid mistake of trying to face them before. Don't. No. Don't. <laughs> Don't. Nice! Wait, what? She didn't get skill or luck? Oh my god. Alright, we got the physics set at least. Oh my god! Oh my god, get fucked. Alright, six use physics set. You know, I fucked that. Alright, let's get out of here. Sorry, we finally seized control of Gross. However, our number of enemies were concealed within the castle. Our here is far from over. Yes, I know. Lang must be stopped here and now, or else we forsake the people of Gross. Sorry, I do too do not intend to let him go. Say the right with these right hands. This is Lang we are talking about. We don't know what he's planning. As if we must take extra caution in fighting inside the castle. Alright. Alright, Chapter 6. The Nest of Evil... Auburn Keep Interior. Alright. Grust has been liberated. All that remains is Auburn Keep, where General Lang remains barricaded. Lang used his influence to steal belongings, daughters, and lives from the people of Grust. Was there ever a man as cruel as he is? I cannot forgive him. 
I shall take him down without fail. Prince Marth raised his sword to the skies and ordered firmly, Altaian knights, charge. Masson, you should be aware that Lang is a general with high defense. To defeat him, you would do well to attack with magic or a special weapon like an armor slayer. Duly noted. If you plan to defeat him with strength alone, you'd have to be extremely powerful. Madison, your strength is quite impressive. You might just be able to defeat Lang. Please, in my stead, kill that insolent man. I'll try. Alright, so now, let's see. So, alright, so I don't need Julian anymore. Now I can bring Morris. Um, ooh, man, I do want to bring Morris. This is gonna get even tougher when we get Fina, like, do I deploy when we get Fina and, um, uh, and my Mermin on, actually. Mm. So, yeah, this, uh, these guys are a bit, like, this guy isn't that scary. It's a strong guy, it's annoying, though. So, do keep that in mind. These guys, the have made some little fire here. Um, wait, do I have a door key, actually? I guess I have a door key. Fuck, I should have bought Torquey! <laughs> Rip. Oh god, you gotta be kidding me. Well, um... That's bad. Um, I don't think I need to bring Yumina for this chapter though, so what I'll do is I'll actually bench Yumina for Gordon. Mm -hmm. And I do want to have one of her rescue staff, so what I'm gonna do is I'm actually going to put the rescue staff on Earth. And I'll have him, so that way, um, Malaysia can actually repair it. And, let's see, um, I do want to bring, um, I have to bring, um, a thief, actually, to open the doors here. Does someone here drop a door key? Please tell me someone knows. Okay, no, no, this guy did drop the door key. Okay, I can actually open the door with him. Oh. Perfect. Wait a minute, is that like the only guy with a door key? Oh no no wait, there's two door keys. Okay, never mind. Okay, so I can open this door with um uh, with one of the door keys I get from the storm guy. And then this armor knight, I can open the door key with him. Okay, so okay, there we go. Okay, nice. And Mars can just get the chest, so I don't even need to bring a Julian mm -hmm. this build, actually. Alright, thank god, because I thought I soft my lock myself right there. <laughs> I don't need any of the bows here. How's Gordon doing? Okay, yeah, he's fine. Oh man, who am I gonna promote? I don't know if I should early promote Masson yet because he's capped his skill and speed. I think I'm gonna give him a, I think I'm gonna lay off, pull off on this promotion. Yeah, give him a couple more, see if he can get some more strength. I don't know about Gordon though. The thing is though, snipers did really good promotion. So they get five skill, mm -hmm. on like, um, five skill and speed from Let's talk um, to Bandavar. Madison, may I have your opinion on something? I'm worried. About Prince Marth or about our next battle? Both of them. This is just a rumor, but it seems Lang has hired the swordsman Navar. Navar, I've heard that name before. He's a remarkable swordsman, right? Yes, but Navar was our ally in the last war, so I'm sure he'll understand if I talk to him. Or if you will not, then turn it on me now instead. Nay, I'll turn no blade of my own. So that's how you persuaded him. Hmm? Yes, why? Madison, if you happen to meet Navar, let me talk to him, please. Is it ever explained, like, why he won't turn a sword on a woman? I don't know. <laughs> I've tried researching <laughs> I don't him. think so. I can't find a single answer on why. Like, I, I'm pretty sure it has, like, the VHS, like, he has some, like, trauma with a woman, but ow, I just hit my life. <laughs> but I have not been able to find it. Gross has been liberated. All that's left now is to seize Auburn and Keith. There in lies Lang, oppressor of, of the people, the one who led General Lawrence to death, the, and the kidnapper of the Christian children. It's time for us to punish him for his sins, and then we shall return to Altea and reclaim our homeland from our beginning. Maybe that's simple, dude. Sir Julius, I see you're heading out. May I ask where to? Just as, you ex as, ex as I expected from Prince Mars tonight, you come on me quickly. The truth is that I was going to secretly gather information. I want to find clues as to where Lena might be. I see. Sister Lena was your special summon, wasn't she? Yeah, I used to be a common thief, but thanks to her, I turned over a new leaf. I don't care what happens to me, I just want to see her smile again. 
Mr. Julian, if you allow me, please let me help you too. Huh? Is that all right? Yes, that desire to do something for those precious to you is something I know well. Alright, Sita and Madison. Hmm? What is this? It smells heavenly. Oh my, Madison. What good timing. I tried to make stew with some leftovers. Would you like to try some? Prince Princess Sita, you've been cooking? Yes, I do hope Marth enjoys what I've made. Oh, that is nice of you. Then if you allow me. Ah, it's amazing. It tastes really good. I'm glad you like it. Do you think Marth will like it too? Well, ah, shadow of a doubt. It's delicious after all. Though you're the princess of Talos, you're obviously skilled at cooking. Well, I may be a princess, but my motherland Talos is just a small island nation surrounded by the sea. I played around outside a lot during my childhood days. I hear they often called me a tomboy. I never would have guessed. Neither would I. <laughs> oh, by the way... Mm hmm? Some time ago, you were our opponent during our train, Princess. I could scarcely believe a princess would fight us. I still remember my amazement at the time. Oh, yes. That time, everyone begged me to quit, but... I suppose I truly am a tomboy after all. Mm -hmm. I can't see it. Honestly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> oh my god, do we even have any money to go into the program? <laughs> I don't think so. Uh... Oh Jesus, he gets doubled, damn. Uh, well, if he wins, I mean, if he gets, he wins. No, no, wait, I did not mean to do that. I did not mean to do that. Oh. He doesn't get doubled, though, so he should be fine. Oh my god, oh. thank you, Ryan. Well. I did not mean to do that. That's that, I guess. <laughs> Alright, level for Ryan, level 10. Strength, skill, speed. Hey, nice. hey, maybe it was for the best. <laughs> no, I'm not challenging again. I don't even have the money for it. Oh my god. Yeah, I use money that we don't have to win for. Alright, so let's see. Uh, see if I can take on these. Um, if I give her a pure bar, she should be fine. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna trade that around. Because I do want to give her a lot of kills, because I don't want Pow to overshadow mm -hmm. her. Alright, let's save and let's go. We're not gonna do this whole chapter today, we're just gonna do some of it. Alright, let's go. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, god damn it. I forgot we have to do the house, everyone. Oh wait, I think I know what I'm going to do this bit streets. There we go, okay. So let's see, Ogma got some train, nice. Cord, uh, found a glass, Ooh. okay. Marth, skill and luck, okay. A laundry pole? A laundry pole? Okay, nice, we actually got them uh, as support with Paula. What is a laundry pole? I gotta see A long pole meant for daily use, not for battle. Oh, one might? What the hell? <laughs> okay. I'll take not it. Again. For battle. I guess I'll take it. A laundry pole, seriously. <laughs> so the ultimates have come. Reinforces are running soon. If we don't hold out a little longer, you can make a pincer attack. No swordsmen are gone. When that, when they open that door, you make your move. There is no need for restraint. Slice them to pieces. Yeah, sure. The knights of Altair are hardly worthy of enemies. Ho oh, ho, that's my Navarre. They say not even Ogma and Talos is your equal. What? Ogma? Naturally, a god that can be so match for me. I see. Glad to hear it. Then I'll leave this place in your hero hands, Navar. So yeah, you can remember. I forgot. Me. It's the. <laughs> what? I know who it is. <laughs> yeah, same here. You can refer me to Ogma or Zorcina. Okay, he doesn't actually double them. All right, that's nice. And on the first turn, I'll actually win one. Oh, wait, I, I forgot to give him that. I'm actually going to take that. 
Podcast. Here we go, level up for Malaysia. Level 10, hit points, speed, luck. Oh my god. He's not getting magic. <laughs> <laughs> what? Two playthroughs in a row. Two playthroughs in a row. of Microsoft. There you go. I don't need this door key. Alright, come on, serious. Ow. Don't kill him. Thank you. Oh, okay. This guy goes for serious as well. Okay. I don't think I'm in range of the swarm guy from here. I hope I'm not. No! Don't heal them all, please. Seriously. Zyre, this is you moving near the front of the castle. We're here to be moving towards our forces. The enemy forces are allies to our cause. We do not know, but we do hope they are allies. So this is me wrong. Yeah, this wrong. Okay, there we go, ladies and gentlemen. We fixed it. To a certain degree. Okay, so this guy, um, let me see. Oh, that takes over this. I need to heal up if I do that. Uh, if I just back up, I think I should be able to Oh, well, oh, but then that opens up this is this cool. And if I go there... Yeah, I can't reach you. How does bars do? Okay, yeah, if I go here, okay, I just have to block off this entire area if I do this. What? Oh, he can move there to attack. Okay, well, uh, I'm fine with that. Yeah, that's not a kill. Alright, what I'll need to do is I'll need to Let's see. Blast, there we go. Don't miss serious, please. I think it's literally just the enemies on the screen that's making it struggle. Yeah, it could be, but there's, there's a lot of them. Because it wasn't doing this in the last chapter. Mm -hmm. And wait, did I? Oh, that was a misclick. Okay. I guess it's like, it's happened randomly, like, especially in the, like, the last time we got together. Skip. Ooh, okay, that's a lot more damage than I was looking for. Oh, come on, god damn it. No! Fuck. Alright, Zyre! Frey, thank goodness you're safe. You too, Zyre. No one and I escaped from Altea Castle. We were here as fast as we could. But the rest of our forces were scattered. I'm sorry we couldn't all make it. You don't have to apologize, you just gotta do your safety. The others can take care of themselves. 
Zaya, from here on, we shall come in. Please give us your orders. Oh, and please be careful. I caught a glimpse of enemy troops approaching the castle behind us. I expect they'll be entering the castle soon. Yep, they will be. Heavy reinforces, I understand. Thank you. Alright, so we can talk about these guys. So, yeah, we have Frey. Um, Frey is, um, uh, like, he's basically the able architect of this game because, you know, he gets, um, like, there's so many cavaliers that it's hard to, like, you know, mm -hmm. put them in a good, like, yeah. place. I think Frey, honestly, is just kind of like, um, Roddy if you didn't train him. Because he's mm -hmm. got pretty good, like, weapon rights. Like, Demon can source Demon advances. He goes to the Carolines, too, and he has pretty good base stats. Um, Frey's like, um, also, he's one of those new units that got added into the remix. And it sucks that you don't get him in the, um, uh, Shattering, because in Shattering, he's actually pretty good. And here, he's also pretty good. Um, he's got, like, 60s vibes and skill and speed, and 55 in mud, 45 strength, and 40 defense. I find that this is a little bit low for this game scenarios, but for Frey, with his 11 base strength and 10 base skill and mm -hmm. 10 base defense, I think he's alright. I think I'll just random. Three out of five stars because he does come in a bit low, low, late for my liking. Because mm -hmm. you know, you have Luke, Roddy, Cecil, you have Sirius at this point, so I don't know if using other cavaliers from here on out is like. Right. Nice, yeah, um, like you said, this, this game is pretty oversaturated with cavaliers. Um, but if you, yeah, like. Him and then later on when you get Kane, I think they're good candidates for like if you didn't train, um, like Roddy and Luke and Cecil, um, they're like just as viable options. Like to me, it's just like, do you feel like training these three from a you know a low level? No, then just wait till you get Frey and Kane. You know, um, yeah, he's fine. Uh, he, yeah. It, it, that's. I feel like so many units in this game are just like painfully okay, you know, and he's one of them. So it's a three out of five for me. Okay. Now there's Norn. So Norn is um uh, your third archer. You get. Mm -hmm. yeah, 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 she's the third archer, but she's the first female when you get. Um, I find like it, you in if you make an avatar, you can actually make them an archer. I find that would be the worst thing you could do to the avatar, mm -hmm. making them an archer. Yeah. And that's what I hate about Norn is that she's an archer and compared to Gordon and Ryan, she actually has good growth rates and her speed is like the highest at 65. Mm -hmm. But her strength of 30 holds her back so yeah. much. And plus, if I had Gordon and Ryan from here on out, and like let's see, she's level five. And like Ryan, well, eh, she has game. Okay, maybe she's a little bit better than Ryan, but uh Okay, well she's basically doesn't have as much strength as Gordon, but she has more speed than uh, well, she doesn't have as much speed. Yeah, she has... Yeah, Gordon has more strength, Ryan has more speed. And honestly, I just find that it's not worth, like, training her, because Gordon and Ryan already have C rank, and they're already on their way to B at this point. And level 5, I find that her base stats are okay, but her growth rates just aren't that good. Like, I feel like you need to play it a lot for it to hold it together. If you've been using Gordon and Ryan, um, I just don't think it's worth it using her. She can be good. I do think she actually is pretty good. It's just that I've been using more and right at this point, and I don't think it's worth like fetching them. Plus, Gordon, I'm using for music at this point, so two stars. Oh, sorry. What did you rate her? Uh, two stars. Two stars. Yeah, I like Norn. Um, I usually actually don't use Ryan or Gordon, so she. I usually use Norn and Caster. Um. It's another thing where, like, I feel like a lot of the units in this game, just because you get so many, they're just interchangeable. But I really like that Norn is fast. Like, she has 9 base speed already, which is faster than Gordon, and then we saw not as fast as Ryan, yeah, but the other really Ryan. close. No, Ryan has 11 speed. Oh, no, actually 10. Ryan, Ryan, yeah. Gordon has, but the thing is, though, you have to keep in mind, the promotion against the snipers get are insane. Yeah, yeah, they are. They are very good. Um... I prefer her over Gordon and Ryan, but that's that's chalked up to like, oh, do you prefer Speedy Archer? Do you prefer one with more strength? Like, that's a personal preference type thing. I don't think either one of them is worse than the other or better than the other. I think she could be pretty good. Um, I'm also I'm gonna give her three out of five stars. Okay. All right, and let's see. so 
Okay, so I think I need to send Sirius to take care of these guys, so... Oh, what? He can't reach? Alright. Um, actually... Oh, wait, I should probably actually send him down, actually, because there's a lot of guys that are becoming in the back. And yeah, they weren't kidding, actually. They, you get a yeah, lot no, they... of guys coming. And they come very quickly. They're... <laughs> they will be here very soon. <laughs> So yeah, I think I'll just have all of mine go and take out this guy. Oh, nice job on the Ooh, nice. Uh, oh my god, Jesus oh. Ryan, come down. Your life's not on the line here like it wasn't the last right. time back in the <laughs> What? Oh, come on, are you serious? Ooh, damn. Oh, damn. oh my god, wow, I didn't think Gordon would take this little damage. Oh my god, what oh my god. The brothers? Yeah, our archers have gotten, like, a lot of defense for archers. Yeah, 12 deep. oh my god, 12 and 11 defense. Oh, I did not... <laughs> really... I didn't realize for an archer, that. that's kind of crazy. Yeah, I did not think they got the best defense. Oh shit, Gordon's going to, uh, 19 minus... Okay, I cannot leave, uh, Gordon there, because he dies now. Oh, actually, this is a perfect time for Nostra to take. Mm -hmm. And Sirius, I think until Massive gets back here, I need him to take this area. Please don't come... Okay, they don't come yet. I think they come in the next turn. Oh my god, Lynn, if you could crit here. Nope, okay. Uh, but, uh, thank god for Nostrums. Okay, how? How does crit here? Not, not bad, alright. Hey, thank hey. you. I was glad this game didn't do that Shadow Dragon did. What? Force you to kill one of her units. Oh, if you yeah. play the Prophet. That I think well, everyone will read that, you know, they got rid of that for I, I still can't believe that they did that. <laughs> They're just like, hey, you know what would be really cool? If we just made you give up forever. Like, I know like, let's... people have, like, you know, they made, like, um, Ma. Oh my gosh, she got magic. <gasps> she got magic. And oh my god. <laughs> At level 11, she finally got it. She got like 1.9 magic after 10 minutes. Oh my god. But she actually became a good player. But yeah, I'm glad that because it was so stupid. Mm -hmm. What was. Okay, I, I gotta ask you this then. Who did you kill? Oh my god, who did I kill? Oh my, I think you should ask who did I leave alive? <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, okay. Um, well, who, like, who did you, who did you forcefully give up? Uh, who I left alive? Like, so, because there's so many units in chat. Who I left alive was, um, let's see, um, Cain and Abel, um, Marth, Ogma Bar Sita. Oh, I'm trying to remember who else I got. I got zero damage. God, I can't believe Sirius actually takes the answer all of so. Skill speed luck. Oh my race. god. Um Gordon, obviously. Yes, I do like using Gordon, okay. That's how much I um Merrick I left on life too. Um, Wolf, I left the light too. I don't think I used it. <laughs> um, I think I... Let's see, who else did I use? Um... Um... At 
Axel. Axel was one of the characters I actually used. Everyone else I did mm. actually used from the, from the guidance, actually. I always wanted to try using Axel. Oh, Axel, I love him. He's good in this game, too. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, nice. Wait, did they not? Oh, no, there's an archer here. Okay. Uh, oh man, I wish I had mass at this point. Alright, Gordon, can you get one of those crits? Nope, okay. Well, your brother can push this guy off. Let's see him. Nice, okay. How much damage does Paula take? I haven't seen this. Ah, 19. Ah, she's fine. I just need to hear her off and make sure she doesn't win. Like, her not using Jack. Oh, come on, Bars. Damn. What the hell? Okay, only two soldiers. Alright, that's not too bad. Ow. Oh, this guy does damage. Okay. Oh, he's still dead. Oh, okay, he was using a... That's why he did zoom damage. Like he was using a... Like, yeah. I think I'll show this point with Sirius and Madison. Oh, this guy sucks. This is four damage to Gordon. What the hell? I don't know. I think, wait, how much? Wait. Oh my god, 11 defense. Damn, I keep underestimating how much defense my, my goddamn archers have. Oh, Jesus, okay. Right. Oh my god, I killed him. Oh, wow. I dodged an 89. Hit points. Okay, oh. that's okay. Well. That was garbage. Wow. Hey, nice shot, series. Oh my god, nice. Jesus. Alright, well, you're screwed. Nope, fuck. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna end this here. Uh, Joe Sex and will be completing the rest of this chapter because this is a pretty long chapter with all the, like, mm -hmm. ambush bomb reinforcements. So, yeah, we'll see you next time. Bye.